Hello and welcome to Logic ERP. Subscribe to Logic ERP YouTube channel and press the bell icon to stay updated with the latest videos. This video will provide you the basic training we learned in day 3 webinar. Go to main menu and open sale bill window from billing menu. You can scan barcode in item code column. Choose lot and enter quantity. You can also enter item manually from item search list. To save the bill, click on save button shown below. To modify the bill, press Alt plus insert from keyboard, modify button will be enabled and then you can click on it and enter the bill number that you wish to modify. To get the print out of the bill, click on print button and a message will prompt whether you want to preview bill or not. If you click on yes, the preview will be displayed and you can print from the preview and the bill will be saved. Or you can also directly get the print by simply clicking on no button. Let us now look at the sale bill touch screen window also that you will find under same billing menu. You can create retail customer by clicking on customer button. Enter the necessary details such as name, mobile number etc. and save it, so that the next time same customer visits, you can fetch the details from the existing database. To enter the payment mode, click on payment button. Select the payment method and click on pay. Don't forget to save the bill. You can also enter a chalan and then retrieve it in sale bill later. To do so, open sale chalan voucher. Choose the customer and then enter the items. Save the chalan. Now, let's see the retrieval process of chalan in bill. Open sale bill window. Select the same account whose chalan was created. Prompt will occur stating that the chalan of the same party exists. Click on OK and proceed further. Now click on retrieve chalan button. Select the chalan that you wish to retrieve in the bill. Then, a window will appear displaying the items that were entered in Chalan. You can select items that you want to retrieve. You may observe that items have been retrieved and details are also picked automatically as entered. Let's move on towards the reporting part. To check the sale report, go to main menu and expand reports and queries. Under sale registers you will find various reports related to sale. Suppose a customer comes to exchange a particular item. In that case, you can enter return in sale bill itself. Transact new item name and click on enter return to exchange the old item. As soon as you select the lot number, a window displaying the sale bill related to the entered item will appear. Select the sale bill against which the item is being returned. This way you can easily exchange the item in bill.
Another case can be where a customer has came to exchange an item but the new item is not available at the moment. In this case, credit note of same value of returned item is issued to customer which can be retrieved later. A credit note is generated in sale chalan return. After the generation of chalan return, we will go back to sale bill and retrieve the chalan in bill. The process of retrieval is simple. Enter the customer details and click on retrieve chalan button. Search for the chalan and select the one that you want to retrieve. After that enter the new item. The customer has to pay only the balance of the two items. I hope this video was helpful. Thanks for watching. Like, share, and subscribe.